property owners. Let's get digital. Property taxes for 2024-25 are due April 1. Payments can be made by April 30 in full, half-yearly, or quarterly installments. Pay via these options. Online at jamaicatax.gov.jm, TAJ Mobile App, Mobile Tax Collection Unit, NCB Online Banking, and Scotia Online and Mobile App. Call 888-TAX-HELP or visit www.jamaicatax.gov.jm for details. A message from Tax Administration Jamaica. All right, welcome back to the Sports Max Zone. It's tax season and the Tax Administration Jamaica is imploring all property owners to pay up their property taxes that became due on April 1st. Property owners, however, have until April 30, 2024 to pay the unchanged amount online or at any alternate payment options. For well, joining us in studio this afternoon to share more on how and where owners can pay their property tax is Courtney Johnson, Taxpayer Education Officer. Welcome to the Sports Mag Zone, Courtney. How are you? I'm doing pretty well, thank you. And it's a pleasure being here on behalf of Tax Administration Jamaica and everybody in the diaspora and Jamaicans all over the globe. It's a pleasure being here. Thank yeah. you. So happy to have you on set. And you know, when people hear property tax, they instantly roll their eyes because it's like, I have to give up my money, right? Can you explain to us and for, of course, our young viewers, what is property tax? Okay, so property tax is that tax that the government of Jamaica, through the Property Tax Act, levy on each person that owns a property in Jamaica. And this is to help to maintain, the uses of this tax is to maintain streetlights, yeah. garbage collection, etc., etc., in one's community. So it is a part of community development and local development at the local area by the local government authority so that Jamaica can be the place to live, work, dwell, and smell fresh. Right. So you have, of course, outlined the importance of paying property tax. But yes. when does property tax become due? I know, well, it went in, on April 1st. You have given an extension to April 30th. But is it every April? Yes. Property tax becomes due April 1. So everybody should have that in their minds right now that, yes, your property tax start save some of the money after March 15th for April 1, because that's the time when it becomes due. According to the law, according to statute, that's the due date. Now, due date is very, very important, because lots of persons think that due date doesn't matter. It matters, because yeah. after the due date, if you're not given an extension, then there are penalties that do apply. So Ooh. we encourage everyone to abide by the due date. How, how big are the penalties? Um, 15% for being late, and there is a, <laughs> um, there is a 10% penalty for an interest okay. for, you know, not doing it on time. I just have one more before I pass over to the man who actually has sure. to pay property tax. Uh, and are there anybody that's exempt from property tax? <laughs> Yes, most definitely. Mm -hmm. There are some organizations that are exempt. And, um, for example, a church with a certain acreage of property, um, they are exempt from paying property tax as long as that property is for religious purpose okay. or for charitable means. Charitable organizations are exempt and certain other organizations. Yeah, well, Courtney, we've spent this week, at least two segments of the show this week, uh, saying thanks to our sponsors, because you are one of our sponsors. Earlier this week, we had the St. Lucia uh, Tourism Authority coming in here because they are uh, also sponsors of the Sports Max Zone. I, I want to ask you this, because there are a lot of Caribbean viewers watching the show. This show goes to uh, 26 to 30 different countries. Um, are there significant variations of how the administration of property tax is, you know, you, you referenced the Jamaican audience just now, but from your knowledge, is property tax administration and the rules surrounding it pretty standard, like throughout CARICOM? Um, it, it is in Jamaica, um, we generally look at property tax as affordability. The government looks at it in terms of can the Jamaican audience, given the per capita income, can they afford this? Can they afford this property tax rate at this time of the year 
per property, per local. And then you would then go ahead to look at, so as it stands right now in Jamaica, the rate that's being used on the books is for the year 2013. So it is affordable for Jamaicans now because that year rate of property tax is being used. Of course, it would be a challenge if the year 2023 is used as the rate. So the government continues to monitor and looks at the, these decisions in a way to improve property tax administration by ensuring that it is affordable, persons can pay it, and it is in line, of course, with, with Caribbean rates. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to ask this as well because there would be the question with regard to what the rates are aligned to. Is it, is it the size of your property or the value of your property or, in a manner of speaking, those things are related, aren't they? Yes, they are. They are indeed. In, in, some, in some sense, what they, the, the government in determining through the National Land Agency and the authorities that rate these properties, they look at where it's located, the local, rural, compared to town centers, compared to residential neighborhoods, compared to low-lying areas. And there is a value band that's placed in this perspective, and hence, that's where you have the rates coming in, and that's where they do the kind of waiting right there mm -hmm. to arrive at. And then, um, also in addition to that, um, there are ranges. So, if your property having been valued is between the value band of one dollar to three hundred thousand dollars, you pay a flat rate. And for most persons who are in that value band, it is. $1,000, affordable. However, as your property value increases, then you go into the other bands. You can go into $2 million to $5 million, and then you pay a different rate. And, of course, the rates are on our website, so persons can appraise themselves of these rates. Yeah. I, at this time of the year, I see a lot of ads on, on television and, and radio urging people to, to pay up their taxes. So it does appear to me as if... Uh, people are unwilling to pay these taxes and they have to be nudged. <laughs> I'm just saying. Is that so? <laughs> well, I, I, I'm going to put it three ways. <laughs> there are those who don't understand the value of paying property taxes, what it does for a community. I mean, I can't begin to imagine if no garbage collection is had because no funds are available from the persons living in the community. But that's what property tax helps one to do. <laughs> and so, there are those who would like to preserve the their value of their property. As a matter of fact, preserve their property. So they know that if they do not pay up, then there are consequences. And, of course, like Grandma, Grandma used to make sure she wake up. She wake up early, early as April 1 come and find the tax office. Yeah. And I guess those were the days when... The donkey was the preferred choice of transportation. But she'll be riding that donkey straight to, <laughs> to make sure that her property taxes are paid. Mm -hmm. So those, those, we, we have those three sets of persons. persons. And once grandma understands the value of maintaining property values, if you have dirty streets, garbage-filled communities, then the value of your property goes down. However, when you pay the property tax, as hard as it might seem, it's a lifetime investment that you cannot afford to miss. Well, you, Courtney, you, you, you sold the project very well. That's <laughs> yeah. all I can say. Yeah, and just remind Indeed. our viewers before we wrap this segment, uh, again, how they can pay. All right, so there are several options available to pay your property taxes. As you've seen, you could go to our TAJ website. That's www.jamaicatax.gov.jm. And you could make your payment using a credit card or a debit card with credit card features. Yeah. Of course, you can download, for those with Android devices, you download the TAJ app. Uh, it keeps you on the go, and you can make your property tax payment from there. In addition to property tax query, and also find a property tax at a tax office where you can go to make your payment. Or we have other 
members of the, the business community on board, such as National Commercial Bank, Bank of Nova Scotia, you can download their apps and, hey, you are ready, and add Tax Administration Jamaica as a pay, and you're good to go. All right. Well, Courtney Johnson, it was a pleasure chatting with you. Thank you so much, of course, for being one of our top sponsors of the Sportsmax Zone. Thank you. And I urge you Thank to head you. across and pay your property tax so they can continue sponsoring the Sportsmax Zone. <laughs> we take a break. Thank you. <laughs>